Hey guys, in this episode we're going to be talking about adding another feature to Rails or improving an existing feature, and that is going to be the route method in the Rails generators. Now this route method allows you to insert code into the routes file in a Rails application where you're running the generator against it. So if you're running the Rails device install, it will add the device for users route at the top of your routes file using this helper. This is great, but it has limitations. And that is something I ran into building the Madbin gem that will hopefully ship very soon. But um, as I was building that, I realized a couple things. First off, we want to insert a namespace into your routes where we can say namespace madmin do and then resources, users, and any other resources inside of that namespace. Now this is great um, and not very hard to do. We can add a multi-line string and use this route to install this. But this has actually been improved in Rails 6.1. I was reading the source code for the route helper in Rails 6.1 and I saw, oh, there's a namespace option that's been added and it will go through and take an array of namespaces and nest them for as many as you have given it and it will put your code inside of that and insert that into the routes file. That's super handy. So I wanted to be able to use this code um, to do that so that we could insert users and everything else into there. However, um, this is fine, but if you were to do this a second time and add, say, a posts, what it would do is create a second namespace block for you. And that's not what I wanted. And if you were to insert resources posts, 